What up, what up, it's your boys and dogs, Casey here, welcome to an unexpected video. My top five scariest games, and I've made the playlist, so, yeah, we're just going to see my top five scariest games today. Some of these you might not find scary, but I definitely did. So, at number five, we have Outlast by Red Barrels. Um, this game was basically... It's really good. It's basically about a, a guy finding news, goes into an asylum, Mount Massive Asylum. As you can see, it's on the screen right now. And he is trying to find stuff, but there's insane people trying to kill him. As you just saw there. He has to go through all this stuff with people yelling at him. And he gets punched and he's doing all this and he writes stuff down and it's a really good game the ending is really good as well I'm not going to spoil it if you guys are going to watch the series but I do recommend it is an 18 as you can practically see right now yeah just have a look at this also tell me did you guys find this game scary On to number four. At number four, we have Illusion Ghost Killer, a game about Jeff the Killer. And you basically walk around, and as you can see on the screen, there is a Jeff which chases you. You have a sprint button. It's. Yeah, you have to turn on some cameras, I think, by pressing E, but Jeff can appear at any time. You literally have to see this. Somebody's made this trailer. Uh, yeah. Have a little look. I don't know too much about this game. But I've seen people play it. I've played it. It's just literally stupid. But it's just getting the life at me. On to number three. At number three, we have Alan Wake. A game by I have no idea. Where you play as a writer. And there's this darkness which comes to kill you. You walk around mountains with a flashlight and a gun. You, you meet different people. It all turns out to be mind-blowing. As you can see right now, it gets dark. Police tell you that you're wrong. Just really annoying, but playing it, just amazing. Hopefully, I'll be able to bring the ending onto the channel because I've nearly finished the game. Oh, yeah, somebody is actually kidnapping your wife because your cabin crashed in the lake. Uh... So you go looking and the kidnappers actually like, I don't know, it's really confusing if you guys go and search it up. On to number two. So for this one, I couldn't find a trailer, so we have gameplay. Uh, this is Forest, an indie horror game, which I personally played, and it scared the life out of me. I've done a quick wrap on it. You just probably can't actually see it. Yeah, it's not very bright game. If you want to download it, it's by Lucas Jackal. It's really good. I mean, overly attached girlfriend tries to come and get you. You can't see her face until you die. And you have to find oil and petrol or something. And you have to find a key. I've never beaten it. But there's like this bad rock and stuff. Like, that was bad I do. That was bad I do. It's amazing. Really good game. If you want to download it, just go on to the place you want to search up for us. This is how I found Markiplier trailer for this game, and then I just saw him play it. It's really, really amazing. I'm going to probably play it quite soon as well, so. And on to number one. Alright, guys, so at number one, a game that I played earlier today. Yep, you've guessed it. Eyes the horror game. It's my scariest game. 
this isn't really a trailer, it's kind of just the guy playing. I called it a trailer. So basically you go around this house and you have a map. You're trying to get bags, and, but there's this really, really scary ghost which can come out and chase you at any time. The eyes show you where the ghost is. If you see, he collects an eye, he presses it, and voila, the ghost is upstairs. So there's three different floors, and once you get the bags, you go back to the exit, and you win. But it's not that simple. It scares you. The... It's just... The ghost could be anywhere. And I have one thing for this game. Don't go down in the basement. Yes, I've beaten it. I beat it earlier today. Video in the description. So that was my top five scariest games. Let me do my outro. Anyway, thank you guys. Subscribe to Cool Kicker and leave a like for more top somethings. And I'll have to see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.